don't give it to you. Fuck way for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to Battle or X here, GBA Season 6, Week 12, the finale of this GBA season. The last time you've seen Battle or X in this mask and in this glory in this GBA season. We won last week trying to end the year with two wins in a row. That puts us in quite the moral dilemma because as you know, we have taken over complete team operations. We have not seen owner Steve anywhere with this team in the past month. We're doing things our way and we are one and two plus two. We have a positive differential in three games without owner Mag, owner Steve, who gives a shit he's not around anymore like my parents never were. The moral dilemma, if we win this week, we can potentially jump to being the sixth pick next year. But if we lose this week... X go give it to you. Fuck wait for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to We have a chance to be the number one overall pick for Sun and Moon. What about it? Whatever, whatever is about what to do. Whatever is X going to choose. Well, if you ever thought for a goddamn motherfucking minute that I'm going to tank for a fucking draft pick, you are out of your goddamn mind. We play to win every week. Buy my t-shirt in the description below. Let's get this show on the road. You should have watched my team builder video yesterday. Those are overwhelmingly underviewed for people who want to know GBA stuff. Watch the team builders. You know what I'm bringing. You, you won't be surprised. My opponent has Zapdos, Nidoking, King, Latias. He traded for Manaphy earlier in the year. Regirock, Mega Absol, and Entei. At Team Preview, I lose. But as you may or may not know, I am not one to be trifled with. I pull defeats from victories, but more importantly, I pull victories from defeats. I take situations, turn them around, you never know what to expect. Let's get going. Any of the decisions I'm gonna lead, with, let's go to normal school. I'm gonna lead with my, Han, with my Heatran. So now I figure, you know, he could he could go for Earthquake, Earth Power while I get my rocks up, and then I, I'm dead. So, you know what? I don't want that to happen. And I feel like he's just going to think, I'm going to eat, I'm going to get rocks up, so I'm going to go right into Honchkrow, and he's going to go for a nice, juicy bulldoze. X go give it to you. Fuck, wait for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to I don't know why I said Earthquake, because I also got to be bulldoze. I pursued him and get the... That was easy. Yes, it was. The crit turn one. He goes into Zap Zap. I don't want to take that. I don't have Evire. For the Zapdos, what I do have is superior play and intellect. Go into my KD25, but you got Volt Switch, that's okay. He's going to get the advantage anyway. But he real, I realize right here he doesn't really have anything for Meloetta. He's going to switch back out right into Zap Zap on the switch into, into Heatran again. So I guess he predicted that there. That's okay. He Volt Switches out. That's not really a big deal. And now we see what he has for Heatran. He goes right back into Latias again, so I'm confused. I just get up a sunny day. And uh, he sees that and goes back. And I don't know what he's doing. He just zap, zap, magma storm gets a lot. Ooh, ooh, juicy. X go give it to you. Fuck way for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to. That was easy. Indeed it was, and he's dead. So there you go. Heatran taken down in the sun. That magma storm dead. Goes into Prince. I am afraid of the Earth Power. I'm going to Honchkrow on this bad boy, and I've just taken ground move. X go give it to you. Fuck way for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to. Two ground moves so far. Now here, here I actually predict him to not go for an ice punch. In fact, he's gonna switch out when I get up the pursuit and I get that shit right. X go give it to you. Fuck way for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to. Uh, crit him with the Night Slash, because I am a Crit Crow, and that's what I do, he get rocks up. How about another Night Slash? How about another Crit? How about all the frustration from all the bad luck I've had all season, culminating into one final resolution? Not to be confused with what the Germans tried to, tried to do in, in Nazi Germany, I, I don't want to be confused with that. I have three more turns of Sun with Venusaur, and uh, I am faster than his whole team. What does he think I'm going to do? No, I'm going to knock off. He loses his Dragon Fang. Uh, and now he's gonna die. So Venusaur just won't be one to Latias, and he is down five. X go give it to you. Fuck way for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to five to three. He has gotta make some moves. He goes into absolutely, and uh, he goes for a knockoff, getting rid of my item, which is a Piapa Berry, as you know. And I go for a Giga Drain to get some of that HP back. And uh, you know he is here to end up taking me out, but I I have answers for this Absol. 
I want you all to be aware of me and Xiao, and he definitely thinks I am Scarf. It's a really weird set. I go, or I'm not Scarf. I'm not Scarf this week. I am sub this week. He thinks I'm going to high jump kick. I'm going to one-up him on that, go for the sub, and he's going to knock me off. I have a time pass. Hopefully, maybe he, but uh, nope. So I got a free switch and a Heatran, and uh, I've seen knock off. I've seen protect. Uh, that's what we've seen. He goes into his Entei on a Magma Storm, and I... <sighs> clutch! Clutch Magma Storm this! Things are unfolding just the way I drew them up. He bulldozes me, I die, and it's just like that, it's down to 3 to 3, but we have leftovers. If I had some leftovers, if I had some leftovers. Now, the last two weeks, Slowbro has been our MVP. We've, he's gone from being crit early in the season to being on the bench because of that. So he's gotten three kills each of the last two weeks. Now, Cooper, if you're watching this, what what only could top that would be if Slowbro were to get three kills in the past three weeks. He got three kills and swept and won a trick room last week. He got three kills week before that against Sam. Could he get three kills with Trick Room and win this week. See, because the way I stand, I can live anything he's going to throw at me. Get up a, a, a Trick Room, his Absol's going to die, his Entei's going to die, and his Middle King are all going to die to Aqua Tail as long as I don't miss. That's fine, right? So, he goes in the... Who he goes in a Prince, and I get a Trick Room up, and he has Aqua Tail. That's one, baby. Slow, bro. How about Absol? How about Absol? What is he gonna do? Aqua Tail? That's two, baby. That's two. And finally, Entei. And decisions. And today, your decision is defeat. Hit him with an Aqua Tail. Three, four, three, nine kills in the last three weeks. The Milwaukee Soft Bucks walk away from season six. Winning a minuscule four games, but having a most impressive back quarter of this, back third of the season. Over the last four weeks, we went loss 0 0, loss 0 1, win 3 0, win 3 0. Something to be said about momentum going into next season. Of course, in Battle X, your resident Wi Fi. It's been a lot of showdown lately. We've had a lot of problems. I've been working a lot of hours this week. And I don't want to. I don't like putting battles off till Sunday, so I gotta play it on my phone while I'm out of the house, and I can still win. Doesn't fucking matter. Hope you all have enjoyed this season behind the first season of Battle RX, and I will be back next year. Don't you fucking forget about me. We'll see you guys. Peace. Exco, give it to you. Fuck, wait for you to get it on your own. Exco, deliver to.